Hello happy people, welcome back to another edition of Nail Therapy Thursday. Today I, I have a little bit of a, a haul slash swatch video for you all. Um, I did end up getting some more of the Beatles dip powder sets. I found them on sale for a really good deal. I am going to link them down below so that you all can get your hands on them too if you want. But um, this is the box that it came in. I got two more uh, 12 sets, 12 piece sets. Um, and so I'm gonna just go ahead and unbox them on camera with you all so you can see which ones I got. Um, again, I really enjoyed the packaging of this. It's just really nice and sleek and cute with the gold detail. I'm gonna take this case out here and this is how it comes. It's six on one side and then six on the other side. So um, 12 bucks, I'm sorry, uh, 12 dip powders for under 10, bu under 10 bucks is a really good deal. So this is the first set here. Um, I believe this is the nude um, collection that I got here. And then the second one that I purchased here, um, let's see. This one here, packaged the same way, really cute, really nice. I did notice though with the two different boxes, like this one had Beatles gel polish on it and this one just had like the regular Beatles, like the actual little Beetle bugs on it. So I'm not really sure, maybe they kind of finished those boxes out and started using a different one. But this is what this set looks like. Um, and I believe this one was called Ruby Red. Let me double check here. Yeah, so this set was called Red Rose. So that's what these colors look like. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually uh, swatch these for you on camera just so you can know what they look like. Um, Again, detailing on the box here is super cute. Really like the Beatles products. So when you take it out of the box here, you have the two different sets of six each, right? And then they give you the instruction pamphlet, which I don't really use too much because I exclusively do my dips primarily with gel liquids. And I actually uh, use the gel liquids in particular for my dip powder. So, I really like that a lot. Kind of happy to be able to keep everything in the same family as far as like using the dip um, powders as well as the dip uh, liquids. I'm sorry, the dip powders as well as the gel liquids. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and take everything out of the packaging here. I'm just show you all what it's looking like. So this one has like a nice array of like different pinks and grays, kind of some mauvey purples, and I believe it has a few glitters as well. Um, one of the things that really drew me to this kit was the clear and the white. Um, I wanted to see what the Beatles clear and white was kind of working with. And so, yeah, I'm going to go through and open each one up so you can see what it looks like in the box. I'm sorry, in the container. And then I'll go ahead and swatch it for you. Here's the Z01 color, and this is supposed to be the white. And I actually have used this color already, so that's what it looks like in the container. Really nice. Here is the Z02. And this is kind of just like a light pink color here. Um, yeah, like a nice, you know, baby pinkish almost color. It's really hard to get an idea of what these colors look like in the container because they all really kind of look the same. Here's another pink color, just slightly deeper than the other one. And this is a, the Z03. And that's what that's looking like. Nice little light pink color here. The next color they have in this collection is the Z04. And that's what that looks like here. And this is kind of like this open here. This one's more like a purpley, pinkish, glittery color. Like again, it, the the in the side the container is really not doing it justice, but. I'll go ahead and swatch those for you here shortly so you can see what it looked like. This one would actually surprise me. I thought this was like another white powder, but this one had some really cool like iridescent um, glitter in it. And I thought that was really cool. So I don't know if the, the camera is really picking it up or not, but I thought that was really, really pretty. And this is the color Z05. The next color we have here is Z06. And this is kind of like a deep, gray color, um, let's see here. So that's what this looks like, a nice deep gray. Mm -hmm. And then we have a, the clear, which is gonna look white in the container. Um, but I noticed with this jar too, because it's clear, it's not like that frosted color, which with the other containers, they kind of have like a frosted container. 
if that makes sense. Like this one's more transparent, you can see through it. And these I feel like a little bit more frosted. So I don't know if either the formula is different with the dip powders or they just did that to make it easier for us to know which one was clear and which one was the white color. But that's what their clear looks like here. Okay. Next we have um, Z08, which is just another gray color here. So that's what this looks like. A nice little gray color, very pretty. Next color we have here is Z09. That's what that looks like. And it's kind of like a, kind of a deep mauve purplish kind of color. Yeah, it's really pretty. Actually, it kind of matches my background here, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks really nice. I like this color. This would be a this would be cute for like a like a fall nude set or something. Then I have Z10, Z10. And this is kind of like a deeper berryish color. Like so. Really pretty. Then I have Z11, which is kind of like a peachy nude color. That's what this looks like. Okay. And then the last color that comes in this set is Z12. And this is a really cute, beautiful, stunning gold. It has some iridescent glitters in it. Like it's really, really beautiful. Okay. Um, yeah, this this does not do it justice at all. So I'm gonna go through and just go ahead and swatch all of these colors for you so you can see what they're looking like and I'll be back shortly. Okay, so this is what the first collection looks like completely swatched. I was trying to get a good angle so there wasn't a glare in the camera, but Starting from this side, um, I'm sorry, starting from here, this is 0, 01 through 0, 06, and then clear through 0, 08 through uh, Z0, Z12. So, yeah, um, that's what the first collection looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox the other one and show you all what those swatches look like. Here is the second Beetle set. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. This is the set called Rose Red. And this one also came with 12 colors, like so. And then it also has the instruction manual that came with it. So I'm gonna go ahead and take all these colors out and then go ahead and get them swatched for you all. Now these are a little bit different. This one actually has the numbers on the bottom, but then it doesn't actually show Kind of like an idea of what the uh, color's gonna look like. The other thing I noticed that's different from these jars and the previous one is that they are actually in the clear jars and not in the frost. Well, actually some of them are the frosted jars. You can see this one is like the clear jar. I don't know if that makes sense, but I can see better in this jar than I can in this one. Here is 037. 037 is, it looks like it's just another white color. So I was actually shocked to find that this had another white in it. So I mean, you can never have too many whites. So that's a nice pretty white. 038 is, looks like it's a kind of like a lavender purplish color. The color in the lid makes it look like it's a really deep pink, but it's more so like a lavender purple color. 039. This one looks like kind of a blue toned purple. So that's what that looks like. Zero, four, zero. And this is a really nice, beautiful bubblegum pink. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this color, especially in the summertime. Yeah, I like this pink a lot. It kind of reminds me of a pink I have from GH Dip. Zero, four, one. Um, and it looks like a kind of sort of orangey red almost um like a fiery red kind of in a sense like a really deep red so that's pretty well not even deep but just a fiery red zero four two and this is a really pretty uh red glitter and i think this is gonna look absolutely gorgeous swatched 
and I think it's probably gonna be a really nice like Christmas time color to use. Like it's, it seems like it's gonna be a really nice red glitter. 043, and this looks like, let's see here. Ooh, look at that nice deep red. This is a nice pure kind of deep Christmas red. I like that a lot. Actually, I feel like the 042 and the 043 is gonna look really cute swatched together. 044. And this kind of looks like a kind of a plum red almost. A purpley red. Really pretty. 045, which looks like a nice deep purple. So that's what this color is looking like. Nice deep purple color. 046. And this one is, it looks like a sparkly purple. Looks like it has um, a little bit of iridescent in it. It's like purple and silver glitter specks in there. 047, which is a shimmery pink color. This is also absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. It kind of looks like that bubblegum pink color, but just with some glitter in it. Yeah, that's really, really pretty. Look at that. Yeah, that's gorge. Yeah, I like that a lot. Okay. And then the last one we have here looks like kind of a rose gold shimmer color, which is the 048. It comes off a little bit pinkish in the lid, but it kind of looks like a rose gold glitter. Here are these 12 colors all swashed out. Um, and this again is the red rose set from the uh, 12 piece Beatles dip powder set. Um, again, these dip powders are very, very affordable. Um, and I do, and I did do a review on my channel using one of the whites. Um, I actually used the white from the other kit, the Z01, but it looks like they have a white in this kit as well. Um, and it did hold up really, really well. I was able to get about two, maybe even three weeks wear out of it. And I ended up applying the powders using the Beatles base coat and the, the Beatles gel base coat and Beatles gel top coat. So yeah, I would highly recommend these dips. I really like them a lot and they're super affordable. I will leave everything linked down in the description box below. I hope you all enjoyed this swatch video. Let me know if you all would like to see me do some nail designs using some of these colors. Um, if you all wanna see me do a dip application, how I normally do my dip powders using gel polish, or I even have some dip liquids too, so if you all wanna see me using these with some dip liquids, I can do that as well. Um, and yeah, just down in the comments, let me know if there's anything in particular that you all wanna see on my channel regarding nail content, because I actually have a lot of fun filming these videos, and so if there's something in particular that you all wanna see, I'd be happy to film that for you. And yeah, leave me your favorite color from the two sets down below. I'd be interested to know which one was your favorite color. Definitely, I'm really liking these glitters from both sets. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Thursdays in particular on my Nail Therapy Thursdays video. So if you all wanna see some more nail content, definitely come back next Thursday. And yeah, as always, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.